Hello everyone, Mario Fan 110 here, and uh, yeah, looks like I found a dizzy dog behind the stairs accidentally, so, well, I am going for 100%, so luckily I found that. And, um, yeah, apparently they don't know where I am yet, which is odd. So, I'll have to go back down and around. Is there anything over here? No. Ah! Back hoops. Alright. Let's go, guys. Alright. Looks like we're gonna get to the bottom of this. Alright. Well, looks like we're gonna need 101 exactly. Well, let's see if we have them all. Uh, what's... Oh no, what's happening? Oh, they look so cute right in that. So that's how you get to this room. Yep. Pretty cool, huh? Oh. Well, fuck the dizzy dial. I just wanted to find it. Uh... Fine. I'll admit, that's one thing harder about this game is that you have to spend coins to get a heart block. In, thousand, in, in, in Sticker Star, you don't need to do that. I, at least I believe you don't. I, I saw a heart block in that game, and I don't remember paying coins, so it's even more like the N64 game. Especially that. And, um, yeah, I like that a lot. So, Come on, guys, let's go. 98 of 101 garbage. There's three missing for some reason. Uh, uh, hmm. Let me see. That thing's gotta be around here somewhere. Mm -hmm. Oh! But, huh? What's that? Whoa, sounds like a mob. Better clear out. Hmm. What could be going on around here? Bushes. Broccoli bushes. I don't know, I like broccoli a lot actually. Especially with milk and cheese. Oh, I'd have that any day. Alright, let's do this. Here we go again. Again. Mario, look, 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 it, it, it's the crystal star. <gasps> what? Did you just, hey, what's going on here? Man, am I lucky or what? Or am I just good? Oh, you say you need a crystal star, little crow. Boom, it <laughs> falls right in my lap. Oh, still, <clears throat> this is humiliating. You shouldn't have been able to escape that cell. So, <clears throat> For insulting my awesome trap, I'm gonna repay you with a little present. You know what it is? Oh, just a little something I like to call a remote time bomb detonator. I'm gonna use this to bury you and those squirmy shooties in the rumble. Sound fun? Well, enjoy your final minutes inside this dang old tree. And with that, pow, I'm gone. Oh boy, we're on a time limit now, folks. Huh, this is feeling like Super Pick Mario if you had any time limit. You know, Pity Mario is going to go something time. Did, did, did he just say, Eek, hurry, we have to get the heck out of here. Well, yes we do. Yes we do. Ugh. Looks like we have to deal with some X-Nots. Alright, let's do this. You know, I really like how they made this. It's actually really cool. Like, you have to pick your commands quickly, and I don't know, just fight back. It's interesting, I'll give it that. It gives a new take on the formula. If 
stick to Stardust already. So. I can't wait for that game. I've been waiting for over two years for that. And by the time it comes out, it'll be like two and a half years I've waited. Maybe even a bit more than that. Stop jumping. There is a star piece around here somewhere. There it is. Okay. Let's go. Alright. Um, oh yeah. Yeah, that's where it was. I love how it's all connected like that. That's awesome. Look, it really is. Alright. Well, looks like we're going to have to make it back, folks. Time is of the essence. But yeah, after I do the boss, I'll find all the um, I'll find all the star pieces in this place, and then I'll uh, then I'll continue. So yeah, this part's gonna be very exciting. Whatever, we, we, we won't. We won't even need the punies. Screw it. It's not like anything bad happens. So, whatever. And yeah, uh, just a bit of trivia for you guys if you didn't know this. Um, if you saved right before the time went up, it actually doesn't stay like that. The time actually resets to a default, like a certain default number, so that's cool. You won't be going any, any farther this way. What? Are you nuts? Move it, you old geezer. What? Did you just call me an old geezer? Why well, did you get off talking like that? I said get off. You got no respect, Brett. Don't think my age has a thing to do with my might. Even if it kills me, I won't let you through. I'm ready. Has the power activate? Uh, whoa. What's your problem, Grandma? You got an ear hair tickling your brain or what? Oh, oh, oh what the? No, what's that? Can't take another step. Oh, ah. What a time where I stupid back to start acting up. Uh, acting up. Ugh. 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 You hot headed old coot. You dare defy me? I could try my boots with you. Um, you that? We aren't going to let you leave, you, you, you big bully. You hand over that crypto star and, and, and get out of this tree. Yeah, get out. Buh, buh, buh. You guys are nuts, you know that. Oh well, I guess I'd better shut off this timer. Okay, you pests. One pummeling coming up with extra fists. Middle fist, that is. Okay, apparently that thing does more than detonate bombs. And that looks like suspiciously like a hamster wheel. Or something. Awake, Magnus von Grovel. Time for our technological thrashing. Enjoy. When I first saw this, I was like, holy crap. That looks pretty damn cool. Yes, it looks pink. It's freaking awesome, though. Shut up. Weak, are you crying yet? Yeah. Sorry, but this thing is an arm of tissues. Well, yeah, this fun problem has an effect on people. Total weeping terror. And you ain't seen nothing yet. Check out the power on this bad boy. Huh, yikes, that thing is strong. Well, but, uh, but I can't shake the feeling that there's something that's not right about him. Be alert, okay? We can't let ourselves get careless. What's suspicious? The fact that he's freaking easy? Yeah, I guess we'll go with that, why not? Let's go. That's Magnus von Grapple. He's a giant robot built by x -Nuts. Lord Crump drives it. Max health is 30, attack is 2, and defense is 1. Its most effective attack is one that takes advantage of its size. A smothering stomp. It can also shoot out its fists, which do these super gnarly rocket punches. Its fists have a max health of 2 and an attack of 4 and defense of 0. Its fists are super powerful, so it's best to knock them down fast. The thing about this robot is, I can't tell if it looks cool or really, really stupid. Exactly what I was saying. Here comes, suckers. Now this one, push! Oh! 
Or in this case, I'd like to say, huh, well, you look like you just came out of tissue paper, or whatever. There's a joke in Snicker Star where Goombas made fun of him and said something about Mario's power is being equal to that of tissue paper. I don't know. Whatever. Nate Bildorf is just, oh, I love that guy so much. He freaking writes all these games, and I love him for it. I just, I really, really do. He's a genius with the dialogue. Yeah! I you like that? That's a guard if I ever saw one. But, um, yeah, speaking of Sigur Star, it will not have Super Guard in turn though. And I like that a lot. Seriously, Sigur Star's going back to N64. Oh, oh, it ain't over yet. <laughs> this is so awesome. Check out what else has got. You're gonna love it. This might not work out too well for you. Yeah, might. Alright, good, we don't have to tattle the rock with this. I mean, I don't know, is that overdoing it? it? Seems to be kind of, I don't know. Um. Ah, screw it. Yeah. Let's get one of these out. Back off! Saving the power point for this fight. Damn it, I can almost never get the timing on that. No! Oh. Alright, we're gonna take this guy in no time. Alright, next turn you're done. Not good, you can't last. Oh, yeah, try stomping me. How would that look, anyway? Like, seriously? Ah, oh, shit. Oh. Oh, what? You got a gradual syrup. Nice. I thought it was gonna be, like, a power punch. <laughs> that would be awesome! It's like, oh, I ran out? Well, here you go. You know what? I think the next part will be dedicated to finding secrets. I think that's what we'll do. Alright, and with that, you are done, Magnus Von Grapple. <laughs> this could be the end. That sounded horrible. Alright, level up time. Seriously, I'm acting like Danger Mario a lot. Ugh. Uh, uh, no. Make this one grapple. How could we lose? Uh. Uh. I'll remember this. Losers. His head was in the ground, but it was the same animation as when he was standing up. Amateurs. Lord Croc summons us. Uh, hey, retreat, heads up, run away, wait up! Uh. That always happens, it's kind of getting old. Wait, did, did Gabella talk? Oh, I guess so. We did it, Mario! Yes! Was that great or what? Ugh. They're gone. This place can go back to the being the peaceful place I remember. A peaceful place I remember. Yep. Yeah. Alright there, uh, uh, Mario. You can have the Emerald Star, or the Crystal Star that presented in this tree. Alright, and with that, Chapter 2 is finished! Not 100%, though. We'll get to that in the next part. So I just remembered, we have the freaking crawl, uh, uh, intermissions! So yeah, we can't do that yet. And so, after Mario, or, and so, after pummeling Lord Crump, 
Mario obtained the second Crystal Star. With the Exonauts gone, peace once again prevailed throughout the Great Tree. The Buffalo Woods echoed with the puny songs of joy, but this may not be the last our hero hears from the vile Exonauts. They will surely continue to stand in Mario's way and try to put a stop to his efforts. What? Say that again. You can't get in touch with Lord Crump. But you are correct, sir. We are investigating now. We should hear any time. Yep. Sir Grotus, please allow me to enter. Uh, yes, what is it? I have a report, sir. The Crystal Star and the Bugly Woods had apparently been taken by Mario. What? You must be joking. What about Lord Crump and the Shadow Sirens? Ah, I'm sorry, sir, but unfortunately Mario did a beating on all of them. Disturbing this Mario character. What kind of thing? Uh, speak up, Exxon. What is the status of the other crystal stars? Uh, sorry, guys, I have to yawn. Okay, there we go. I apologize, sir. We are still searching for, uh, for, other, uh, for the other crystal stars. Unsuccessfully, sir. We knew of three of them Hotel Castle, Bobbly Woods, the one we got in Rome Port. That means there are four crystal stars left out there, and we will have them. Keep looking so that Mario won't be the super punch. Yes, sir. Okay, well, I beat Magnus Von Grapple with the power punch. Is that any good? As I suspected, there's no reason to doubt that Mario has that map. He must. Listen up, you. I want you to keep a close watch on, on what Mario does from now on. Absolutely, sir. Even though you probably don't hear about it again. Mario, I love you. Oh, Mario, did you even read the mail I sent you? I wonder. I wonder so many things. I wonder how everyone's doing at the castle. Huh, kind of like the first game. Will I ever, will I never dance at the mushroom ball again? What will become of me? <sighs> I guess I'll let her have a shower again, because, oh gosh, it looks so hot. Nobody will mind if I take a quick rinse. Huh. That's awesome. Ah, uh, <laughs> Super Mar yeah, Super Mario 64 reference right there. What, uh, what she sang. It's awesome. Wow. She's... Damn. If only I had a girl that'd be quick in the bathroom. Jeez. Kind of refreshing. I feel like a new princess. Seriously, like, a majority of females take so long. It's ridiculous. Hmm. Nothing yet. Oh, there we go. How do you know, princess? Oh, is this text tweeting again? Seriously, she knows before the door opens. Alright, well, I better make this quick, because... Time will be uh, running out for me, so better hurry this up. Hello, Princess Peach. I'm glad you came. That mail I sent to Mario, uh, did it reach him all right? Yes, I can confirm that Mario received the mail. Is that so? Well, good. So what do you want from me today? Is there more you want to know about love? Of, of love? Uh, you expressed regret earlier that you would not be able to dance at a ball, correct? <gasps> Excuse me? Were you eavesdropping? I am sorry, Princess Peach. I have been ordered to keep surveillance on you. But it is odd. When you said that, I had an impulse to dance with you as well. How my CPU would produce this impulse is inexplicable. Uh, I must find out what caused it. To find out what caused it? There's no reason behind such a feeling, Tech. Wanting to do something together, it's part of love. I know it. But then again, you are, well, a computer. Princess Peach, please dance with me. But wait! Wait just a minute! What am I supposed to do? You say you want to dance? It's just so... bizarre. I mean, how in the world can I dance with you? You have no arms or feet. Or moves. 
Would this be an acceptable dance substitute? Oh, oh my goodness! Is that me? Did you create that? Well... Alright, I guess. I must say, though, it's going to... I must say, though, it's going to feel weird dancing with myself. Alright, guys, quick cut, hold on. Quiet, dogs. Press the buttons that they display on the screen. Let's dance. I must say, this is like incredibly interesting, especially for Paper Mario standards. Because this is like the only time you get to see this kind of animation from these characters. Unless it was in Sticker Star somehow, like a dancing scene. I doubt it though, honestly. And there we go. Thank you, Princess Peach. That was very fun. Just a moment. Fun. Is this impulse I feel the concept known as fun? The tech, are you okay? Princess Peach, I will fulfill my promise to you. Please use my communicator. Use the keyboard to send whatever message you want. I'm finished, tech. Could you send it? has been sent. Please go back to your room. I want to analyze the data from this dance immediately. The data that I thought was fun. You're a weird computer. No, you're mistaken. I'm the most best and only perfect computer. <laughs> Good night, Princess Peach. Yeah, when she was walking out, she was still smiling, so she thought it was awesome. She's warming up to it. She's warming up to that computer. Oh, sweet. I'm pretty sure it's just up ahead here. Great as usual, Lord Bowser. We just got word that Princess Pete was piling the town up ahead. Up ahead. Good, yes, very good. Then I'm off. These tools don't know what's coming. <laughs> My lord, you're so super. Ready to roll. Alright, let's go. Yay. I'm playing Super Paper Mario. Or something of that nature. Oh, oh, this game sucks. Oh. What? But I pushed back. Son of a bitch. Yes, my microwave. I'll get to you in a second. This is pretty damn cool, I have to say. But no, people are like, oh, Super Paper Mario sucks. Oh, God. Yay, and this is the Mega Star from Super Paper Mario, so. This was obviously expected, people. Yeah! whenever you die, or it keeps going up a level, like when you die. Whatever, Super Paper Mario was awesome, that's proof of it. Oh hey, welcome to Pedal Bargain. Uh, uh, ah! Hide everybody, hide! <laughs> what a wuss. Yes, hi chickens, I have no need for any of you. What I do need though is Princess Peach. Now, where is she? Tell me this instant. Huh? Lord Bowser, over there! Bingo, Princess Peach. Oh, man, that was easy. I found you, my princess. I, Bowser. 
the mighty Kakuba King offer my greeting. You're right. Uh, now, now, none of that silent treatment. You come into my castle with me. Uh, 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 clearly she's a sorbic one. Enjoy this, she's speechless. The mind of a maiden is, well, rather complicated. Huh. I see, I see. How refined, how elegant, awesome. I suppose I, I could live with a southern princess. It might even have its perks, you know? <laughs> oh, I get that, Bowser. Really, I do. No! My, my, my last treasure! I'd rather die than give up my life-size peach poster. Life-size peach poster. What?! P poster? Oh my goodness me, I, I didn't see that coming. Great, just great. Now I look like the huge, mighty king of guys who talk to posters. Just wow. Alright, that was the best interlude ever. Uh, thank you, Mario, for everything you've done. We can go back to our peaceful way of life now. You know, son, now that we get right down to it, I'm kind of sad to see you go. I do love pontificating, uh, pontificating. So come on by whenever you want to sit and chat for a while. Yes, please come back and visit. We'll watch for you. Well, we'll work together to, from now on to prevent anything like that from happening again. Thanks for showing us how to stick together, Mario. Good luck with the Crystal Stars. Oh, I'm sure we'll be back again at some point. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Take care, guys. See you, Mr. Mario. Oh, yes. Bye-bye. Ha. Uh, when I, yeah, whenever I leave this chapter, I do kind of feel sad. I really do. And now we're back here again. But, um... Oh, wait! What am I thinking? We still have to get the star pieces. I forgot. Yes, microwave! I'll be there! I'll, I'll be bare? I'll be there in a second! Well, I guess we'll hang out now, guys. Uh... What are you guys looking at? Cool, this music. It's, yep, yeah, it stays. Alright, so with that, we'll save, and then, uh, yeah, the next part, we'll get all the star pieces that we need to get in Chapter 1 and 2. And then the part after that, we'll continue our adventure and get, finally get to the west side of the damn Rogueport place. So there you go, guys. See ya.